Can you hear me? What happened? You nearly died. Your brain was almost out of oxygen. You'll be seeing black spots for the next few days. The rest of your senses will recover naturally. <coughs> Did it work? Did they come? No, Mr. Walker. There was no visitation. I waited as long as I could, but finally, I had to revive you. They seem to have repaired the damage done by the bullet. <laughs> How did you get in here? I go where Grace goes. I've been charged to protect her. Have you? You can't even protect yourself. They may have given you speech, Pepper. Even a parrot can be taught to mimic. But did they give you the capacity to think? I sincerely doubt it. Tell me, Polly, what did they put inside her? I won't tell you anything. If you're not going to tell me, then I'll just have to find out for myself, won't I? X-rays will harm the life growing inside of her. That's a chance I'm willing to take. Stupid man. You think they'd allow you to continue your barbaric practice? She's protected. Your X-rays won't penetrate her body. You'll see nothing. Oh, but they've been watching you. You think you're like them with your clumsy experiments. But they laugh at you, Dr. Arden. They make jokes. Here's a good one. Knock, knock, who's there? Arden, Arden who? Arden, you the quack who'd make a better duck. <laughs> huh. Well, if taking x-rays won't work, perhaps more invasive observation will. I think her condition calls for an emergency C-section, don't you? You can't do that. Watch me. Dr. Arden, you still see me as microcephalic? No one takes a pinhead seriously. When my sister's husband drowned her baby and sliced his ears off, he told everyone I did it. They tied me up and paraded me in front of the judge. He took one look at the shape of my head, and I was locked up for good. That's how it works with us freaks. We get blamed for everything. But if something happens to Grace in here, and she's harmed in any way, there won't be anyone else to blame. They'll take you, open up your head, and stir your brain with a fork. And when you return, you'll experience firsthand how people treat us freaks. I'll take care of Grace. Why don't you go to your whore nun? Have her soothe your deflated ego. Huh? Huh?